Well, while quarantining during the pandemic has led many to explore new hobbies, including tending to your backyard. A lot more time to do that. 7 News' Christine Scarpelli, she's live at the South Carolina Botanical yes. Gardens with expert advice for tending to your <laughs> garden. Good morning, Christine. Oh, thank goodness for my expert. Yeah, Kathy, the garden manager down here, she was just telling me, look out for brown, brown. We don't want brown, brown. Green, green <laughs> is good. Green, brown, it's like a traffic light here. This is such a neat thing. We've learned about everything this morning from watering to things you can do with kids, like these bean plants. What a cool thing to do inside. But Kathy, would you tell us about the plant sale? I know you guys have such a cool thing coming up, and it's one of your big fundraisers. It is. Too. It's our biggest fundraiser of the year. Well, we have a spring and a fall plant sale. It'll be starting, it's going to be virtual this year. Nice. It's going to be starting April 5th. It's for Friends of the Garden. So if you want to join the garden and become a friend, it starts from $45 and goes up a year. Um, that gets, lets you shop the first week, April 5th through 12th. You get first dibs on our virtual plant sale. Oh, nice. um, after that, April 12th or 13th, it's going to be open to the public. That link will be on the garden website. Very It'll good. be a big banner for the plant sale. You order your plants online. We arrange a pickup time for you. You just set up your time, come through. It's contact free. We load your car and you drive away. We're going to have everything from, we've got blueberries, we'll have fruit trees, all kinds of edible fruits. So behind we're, us here, this is one of the, because we've been talking about yeah, these, these are, all morning. These now are the, I want to tell this people. This is just a small representation. Where we've to got, get them? We've got hellebores, delphiniums, um, a gardenia, fatsias, and magnolias. A lot of these you have potted, but then you can plant them outside. And then these are all to go out in your yard. We'll yeah. have your summer vegetables, peppers, tomatoes. We'll have your summer annual flowers. We'll have a great selection of perennials, a great selection of native plants. Kathy, awesome. Thank you for also giving me a path on my growing journey, starting with my orchid. She's going to help me keep alive. I'm going to move to this blueberry branch next. I'm going to do this tree. I'm going to get blueberries. You guys watch. Check back in a year, and we're going to see what happens. All right, guys, send it back to you, but don't forget our website, right. WSPA.com. We, you can ask you got to keep us there. posted an entire year. Okay, we're going to come back to that. Done. And you know what? Whatever advice she gives yep. you with your orchid, Give it to me. Please give it to me because I ha I love orchids too. Got it. But, you know, the most I can get is like 30 Three days out of them and that's on it. On Sunday, Alexa tells me at noon. <laughs> All right. Gotta Thanks, Christine. Gotta we got to go. They're wrapping me. All right, Fred. Coming up on Carolina Morning, going nuts over peanut butter. We honor PB lovers on their 